Welcome back to another C++ tutorial. And today we're going to be formatting a phone number that the user enters and we're going to make it look like the output. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to need some variables. So in this case, I'm going to just use longs. So we could say long phone number. This is the, like the variable that will store the user input. And then we could do long area code, which would just be the first three digits of the actual phone number, which would be the area code. And then we could do mid three, mid three numbers. So the mid three numbers would hold the uh, five seven five in this case. And then we could have another variable called last four numbers. And the last four would just hold the last four numbers of the phone number. And now we just need to get user input into that phone number. So we could do C in and do phone number. Okay. So now we're going to use some like division and use the modulus uh, operator to actually get the like the first three and or the mid three or the last four. So let's start with the last four first. So in order to do that, we could say last four equal to phone number, and you can use the modulus operator by ten thousand. So this is telling the computer we want the last four digits of this like of this long, long variable right here, and the last four digits would be two one four five. And that would be the last four numbers. So we're done. We're, we're actually done with that part. And then we could do the mid three. We could do something similar. We have it equal to phone number. And we could actually divide, which would shift us to the right. So let's shift to the right by four because we have four zero. So it's going to shift to the right by four. So we're at one, two, three, four. We're at the five, right? And then we're going to tell we want the like the far most three numbers. Uh, so we could do that the same way we did it the last time. We could do the modulus, divide by modulus, and it will tell you the last three numbers, the far most three numbers. There's three zeros, so we want the last three numbers. So it would be five, seven, five. So now we have the mid, the mid three numbers. Now all we need is an area code. So you could say area code is going to be something similar. Equals phone number. And then we're going to divide by 10,000 again. And then we're going to divide that. By 1,000, and that will give us the like the last the, the first three. I mean, so we're gonna shift shift over by by four because there's four zeros. And be one, two, three, four, and this is telling the computer we only want the first three, which would be the 209. So we have the last four, the mid three, and the area code. And now we just have to print it out, which would be the easy part. We do C out, and I'm gonna make it match like the output. We could have the first little whatever the curly bracket, whatever it is. We could have that, and then we can print the area code. And then after the area code, we need the second curly break, curly bracket, curly brace, whatever it is. Okay, now we have that. And then like the actual format, there's a space, so we could do just an empty space. And then it's the mid three numbers, which you name name the mid three numbers. It's a good variable name. And they have a dash. So you put a little dash. And then we can do the last four say inline and if we did this correct this should format this number right here to match this output right here so let's run it it's gonna make me type it in but it's okay 209-575-2145 this isn't my number I just made it up but don't call it it might be somebody's and then it formats it just like the output right here you can see I can put the code on screen and this helped you at all or you just like watching leave a like and subscribe